I think the bill uh, fits uh, the environment, meaning that we should be conscious about the environment uh, and not smoke on the sand, on the beach itself, because it actually, it's harmful. I think it's ill-advised because you're restricting, it's just another restriction of, uh, of people's rights. You're in a free open area here, and uh, it doesn't make any sense to me to restrict people's rights. It might fringe upon your rights, but you also have to look at, at the, uh, the issue, you know, you have to flip the coin. You have to say, hey, it's bad for the environment. Nobody likes to see adverse effects on the environment, and certainly nobody wants to see beautiful landscaping like this affected by litter. The reality of it is, if you provide trash receptacles or proper receptacles for cigarette butts, and that's where they'll end up. When I smoke, especially on the beach, um, I dispose of the cigarette buds. I take them back with me and I trash them. When I'm finished with, I have a tube that I carry that I actually put it in and, and it's airtight. But most people will find a proper trash receptacle to dispose of it. Especially when the beach is busy, especially in the summertime, that really bothers me. They don't care about that. They just toss it everywhere. You have to be a responsible, conscious smoker. Absolutely, and that's part of the resp personal responsibility. Of, you, you have rights, but yet you have to take care of your debris. Well, just the further you restrict people's freedoms like that, the more they, uh, they, you know, fight against it. And uh, from what I've seen, if you provide the right trash receptacles, people will use them. If you don't, the cigarette butts are going to end up on the boardwalk because you're certainly not going to curtail smoking.